Previously on Greek, you were my little brother. So trust me, I'll take this back. Going back to Omega Kai. So Evan wins. You know, we said we weren't gonna let our houses get in the way of us being friends. You did nothing to stop it. It was a prank. I used to see everything in terms of whether it would piss off my parents. I just didn't want people to think that I was dating you to get to her. Calvin, you like Michael, right? I think so. Gentlemen, it's time to get your fake IDs. <laughs> Chad Stewart. <sighs> well, I'm not interested in being anyone's warm body. I'm gonna go tell Casey I'm an idiot. I don't want her back. Casey wants us to be friends. And I said I was on board, but I don't think I am. Did you pay Shane Mullen to stay away from me? Okay, yes. How could you be so spiteful? I didn't do it to be spiteful. Then why? Because I love you. I think you should take some time. Get your head together. I think we're done here. Maybe instead of trying to keep all the guys away from one girl, you should find a girl who thinks you're the only guy in the room. So, why do you want to be a lawyer? It was easier to follow Evan's path. I know what kind of law I want to practice. None. Hey, Dale, can you pick up my mail while you're you're packing? It's spring break. Why would I not be packing? Because I just assumed that you were going to be sticking around campus this week. I need a break, Rusty. You know, I'm not a machine, contrary to what my academic performance might imply. So while you're submerged in surf sand and sin with your fraternity brothers in South Carolina, I am going to be engaged in something far less reckless in Virginia. You're... Ah! I have no idea. Wild turkey hunting with my family. I was killing turkeys safer than going to the beach. Rusty, are you familiar with the dangers of spring break? Uh, I mean, drunken injury, pregnancy, parasailing gone awry. And what about the people injured or even killed while hunting? They're just morons. Dale, come on, this is spring break. This is the most sacred of college traditions. Why would you want to waste that on your parents? Wouldn't you rather do something with your friends? Like, take a road trip to warmer weather. As if it ever gets that cold here. All right, well. Have fun killing turkeys, Dale. Have fun perpetuating stereotypes of wasted, reckless youth, Rusty. Two minutes, girls. And windows. Check. The house is officially ready for lockdown, which means in two minutes, I'm officially on spring break. <laughs> Woohoo! I can feel the weight of my presidential duties lifting from my shoulders. Well, could you put it on my suitcase? We're going to Myrtle Beach for a week, not a year-long expedition to Mars. I know, but I have to bring everything that Teresa bought me. Teresa? Teresa Visa, she is very generous. But your card is a credit plus. I know, but nothing cute rhymes with credit plus. <laughs> there, you think this will fit in your car? Lucky for you, I packed. Light. All I need is sunscreen, a sarong, and an iPod filled with beach music. I am leaving the rest of my baggage behind, literally and figuratively. <laughs> well, no Jimmy Buffett. We have plenty of time to listen to him when we are old and sad. <laughs> okay, no Buffett, no ex-boyfriends, no Zeta Beta business, and most of all, no worrying about the gaping hole that is my future. I plan to flirt with boys and check things off the spring break list. Oh my god, where did you find this? Rolled up from my old beach towel. Do you remember when we made these freshman year? We were such wide-eyed spring break virgins. Well, there's still a few things on here, and I'd like to finish it. Oh, like what? I'm playing a drinking game, entering a contest, and skinny dipping. Ooh, Casey Cartwright gone wild. <laughs> oh, it's time. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Spring break away! Woo okay, five, four, three, two, one. Lift off! Woohoo! Better, hurry up, you're wasting valuable party time. Get in here. Aboard! We know you have many choices in travel, and we thank you for choosing Capitao Air. I love this bus. This bus is taking the Capitao to Myrtle Beach for 32 spring breaks in a row. It is a legend. Pledge Cartwright will be serving chips and pork rights in the main cabin. And this bus makes only five stops, and five stops only for gas. Well, what about it only for gas? <laughs> this is so cool. Come on. Come on, come on. Hi, we're checking in. Ahoy, mateys. Welcome to the Yacht House Inn, where your vacation is ship shape. How may I help you? Reservation under Zeta Beta Zeta, CRU chapter. 
two rooms for the week. Enjoy. I said final answer. I think there's been a mistake. We have five rooms reserved. Uh, no, you don't. Well, then we'll take three more rooms, please, and you can put it on the card. <laughs> We're sold out, Shug. I don't know if you've heard, but it's spring break. Connie? We'd like some ice in my room, please, and a few extra towels. Yes, Miss Logan. Rebecca, you're here, and so are you. Finally. How did you beat us? We took her father's jet. And it was awesome. <laughs> And Daddy's travel staff booked us this huge suite. You should come up to our floor later. Rebecca, wait up. Um, there's been a minor snafu with our reservation. Would you and the Pudges be willing to share your rooms with us sisters? After all, nobody wants to sleep on the floor. Um, actually, we were going to use this suite to bond as a pledge class. Having sisters in the room would change the dynamics, so. No problem, Phil <laughs> Sis. Um, who plans on sleeping anyway? <laughs> I got this dingy motel, and this is even dingier than I imagined. Oh, Who's that? A, a car backfiring, probably. Hey, whoever wants to get downtown, we are leaving. Oh, hold on. Isn't this place great? Only one I need out of nine? Spring break! <laughs> hey, has anyone seen my bag? Double fisting tonight, huh? No, just just single fisting. I mean, I'm single. Just an FYI. Well then, I hope to see you around. No. Where have you been? <laughs> Guess that beer friend was more of a marathon. I just met the man I'm going to molest. <laughs> he is crazy gorgeous and super generous. He opened our beers with his shoe. Hey, yes. <laughs> so who is he? Where's he from? No clue. <laughs> but that is the great thing about spring break. All new boys to play with. Ooh, please tell me it's not the guy in the do bag. I know how you love men with accessories. No. <laughs> okay. Who the hell is he? I'm sure he's around here somewhere. He's like a Bigfoot. No. He's the hotness monster. This, this is a party. It's great, huh? It's like the Omega Chi parties, only with less clothes. Yeah, and that, my friend, that is the beauty of spring break. Wow, some uh, pretty chilly body language. Yeah, well, I think I'm ready for a new conversation, Joe. Happy spring break, Alex. Right back at you, friend. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> let's keep moving. Uh, nothing to see here. Wishing you'd taken the jet. And Miss Beaver Moon, a state trooper, never. Our spring break pilgrimage is a sacred tradition. Well, if you want to ride home, this guy's pretty friendly. Miss Logan, you're putting my tray table in its upright position. Let's go for a walk on the beach. Uh, but I was gonna meet the boys out. We're gonna go to a bar where you can get all-you-can-drink beer for five dollars. We just spent all day with them on the bus. It's happy hour. You should come with us. Look around. We've got you, me, the moon, sand, surf. Be romantic, right? Spring break is for being rowdy, not romantic. Our romance is often rowdy. I guess I can take a little stroll. Great. Grab my jacket. I'll grab a beer. Okay. Well, 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 if it isn't President Cartwright. <laughs> Actually, it isn't tonight. I'm just spring break, Cartwright. With patented dual beer grip. Uh, here, a gift. Thank you, I love gifts. <laughs> Enjoy, I've got to get going. We're playing Thumper. 
a drinking game with your gag reflex? <laughs> On my spring break list. Oh, a blast from the past. So you're gonna pierce your belly button again? Once was enough, thank you. I'm just tackling some unfinished business. Like Cooper. You in? Well, you might want to find an easier target. Is anyone easier than you? Oh, how I would love to prove you wrong, but I promise we'll be like a walk on the beach. Oh, well, very romantic. <laughs> yeah. Am I interrupting something? Not at all. In enjoy your walk. Yeah. Maybe we can spend two hours. Think of how far we've come. I just want to dance it out. See your IDs, What? I'm a really good dancer. Okay, hey, you ready? Frank, Chad Stewart, 2343 Avenue, Sunshine, Florida, 47283. Chad Stewart, musician. No. Hey, Spitter, is that you? Maybe we can say that guy stole your ID. We'll totally back you up. What are the odds? I can't go in now. Uh, we'll just go somewhere else. Yeah. No, it's okay. I'm just gonna go back to the motel. I'll rest up for tomorrow night. Time to go bananas. Yeah. All right, man. good luck, Spitter. Thank you, buddy. I need please. Um, hey, guys, come on. Look at this line. There is no way we are waiting in this line. Ladies, I... So we are looking for some new bike drinks. Blueberry barnacle with vitamins, please. Thank you. I don't know what I was thinking. That was at least like 50 yards or something. This shirt does not work. Hey, sorry, I missed you last night, Spitter. Do you have the pledge to get rowdy? <laughs> you okay? Still has my flare up. All right, well, if you need anything, let me know, Spitter. Okay, will do. Mmm. Healthy. Cheers. Hey. Hey, are you in Myrtle? Are you having fun? Oh, things are fine. I'm just sitting on the beach, uh, just relaxing from a full night of partying. Are you using your inhaler? No. <laughs> You're still using your inhaler, liar. Fine. Using my inhaler. I meant about you having fun. I just kind of expected this to be the most amazing time of my life. It's the New Year's Eve syndrome. You can't always live up to the hype. I blame the media. I've been up since 4 a.m. when the rest of the pledges got home from that club that I couldn't get into because of stupid Chad Stewart. Who's Chad Stewart? I have no clothes. I have no travel guide. And for some reason, my stupid ass was back. But I mean, the worst would be behind me, right? Are you wearing sunblock? Any spotting? No, the hotness monster is an elusive beast. What do you think, Mandy? Over there? Prime real estate. Thank you. The tropical storm, Rebecca. I slept in the bathtub last night because of her, and now she's ruining our boy view. Why can't you get over it? Have you ever considered she might be threatened by you? Why? She's the senator's daughter with the invisible jet. Because you're Zeta Beta president? You're beautiful? Come on. Because you're the ex-girlfriend to a certain Kathy with whom you looked pretty chummy last night. Hey, Spring Breakers, about five minutes, we're gonna start to stay half the contest. Winners get free drinks at Club Paradox. Whatever. Kathy and I are finally friends, truly. I'm over him. Just like I'm over drama, remember? Which means I'm not gonna let this beached whale get me depressed. Let's go build a sandcastle. I don't wanna get my bikini wet. It's for display purposes only. Oh, come on. Entering contest on my list. Ah. You seem to not be enjoying the parade of possibilities. Oh, uh, well, it's not really my kind of parade, you know? Right. Well, you know, we go to a gay bar around here. They have cages. <laughs> well, that was a lot of information. When Casey and I came down here our sophomore year, she wanted oh, she wanted to go okay. because she heard that they had cages that you can dance in, so we went. Well, thanks for the offer, but uh, I'm not looking for a guy, you know? Where's the one I already have? 
remember what it's like when you're so excited about someone you want to spend every waking moment with them to make up for the time you're not together? Oh, man. Look, I'm sorry. No, no, it's all right. Hey, stud. You up for some volleyball? Absolutely. Well, the girl, you think you're fun. I don't know. Well, my friend thinks you're cute. Yeah, no. Uh, you go. Have fun. You sure? Yeah, go on. Ah, uh, Michelle. Are you sure you have to go? Yeah. Honestly, I totally forgot that I have this project due for my polymeric materials class. It's due on the Monday when we get back. Damn the competitive world of polymer science. Well, don't be too hard on yourself. You can't win them all. Well, travel safe, Spitter. I got you a little gift for the road. I'll see you next week. Ah! That's all right. Hello? Is this a she? No, thank you. I don't need a subscription. Look, I'm in college. I have no need for a newspaper. Actually, this isn't about a subscription. It doesn't matter, but I can talk to you about it if you have a couple of moments. Isn't this fun? I've been building stag castles since I was 12. Back when my biggest burden was having to play with Rusty. Yeah, I just wish there wasn't all this sand. It lingers in places long after you leave the beach. <laughs> I think the hottest monster has reached the surface. Look, we'll go get him! <laughs> I got it! Hey! Oh, sorry about that, Case. Uh, can I give you a hand? Actually, I could use a torso. Well, looking for you, I'm well versed in torsos. You sure you have time? Rebecca's not planning another walk on the beach. I got all the time in the world. As long as we're done by five, she booked us a banana boat ride. A banana boat? You? I'm mad enough to ride a giant yellow phallus. Besides, <laughs> it's Rebecca's first spring break. I vaguely remember you riding one your freshman year. All right. It was the first thing I crossed off my list. I guess it's the circle of life. <laughs> it's really good to see you so relaxed. You're like your old self again. Thanks. Huh. But your mermaid is in dire need of a breast augmentation. I'll be right back. Rebecca, wait up. Hey, up. Where are you at? Back to my room. Thought I'd take a nap. Will you have some company? No, um, no, have fun. Hey. Are you okay? Why wouldn't I be? Just got off a dispatch. We should have another bus to take us back in about six hours. Oh, thank you very much. Hey, Calvin, where are you going? There's got to be a town up ahead. I'm just going to head over and find a rental car. Oh. Uh, Calvin, can I go with you? Suit yourself. Uh, 
All right, what are you going to contribute? Thank you. Thank you for your contribution. You're welcome. I'll get the drinks. I know, right? Look how packed it is. Yeah, and I bet you've met a majority of the female population. What? You want to come hang out with us? Uh, no thanks. You don't have fun. Okay. I need to rent a car, please. Um, just one way to Cypress, Ohio. Well, I'm gonna need to see your driver's license and a major credit card. Sure. When you get your own credit card. Oh, hon, I'm sorry, but you've got to be at least 21 years of age in order to rent an automobile in the state of North Carolina. So I can die for my country, but I can't rent a car? And I've heard that one before. I'm sorry, but the law is the law. I'll get it. And this... Baker in my hair color. What? No, it's not. There's no way on God's green earth that you're 24. I am. My name is Chad Stewart. I live at 2343 Homer Terrace. What color are your eyes? What color are my eyes? That's what I thought. Damn it. I'm gonna need to confiscate this. But take it, because it's cursed or something. Rusty. When did you get a fake ID? shouldn't have left the bus. No, this isn't my fault, all right? I didn't invite you to join me. I didn't want to let you walk off in the dark alone. Oh, gee, Russ, I feel so much safer now that you're here. Fine. You're on your own. I'm going to get my own ride home. Fine. Just how I want it. Wasting the last four months on you. Stop acting like a spoiled daddy's girl who didn't get away. It's a cliche. You know what? We're done. Consider this our swing breakup. Rebecca! Don't go! You chased the booms away! Oh. Are you okay? Chambers! Man, where have you been? Uh, what? You know, I made some new friends. Friends? 
as, as in plural. You guys, Chambers is on a roll. All right, all right, all right. Yeah. Settle down, settle down. Well, what's, what's going on? You guys going to the condo? No. What are you, my grandpa? We're going to Paradox. Oh. No, no, no. There's, there's no way. There's no way I'm going back to that club tonight. You want to raid vending machine? This sounds so good. Let's go. <laughs> Hey, I'm sorry to drive all this way. Oh. You can take us to the nearest bus station if you want. No, I'll drive you guys back to Cyprus. No big deal. What about the hunting trip with your parents? Uh, apparently my mom's been hitting the firing range pretty hard and has developed quite an ego. All right, Rusty, do you want to tell your side of the story first? Not really. We've got four more hours to go, okay? It's been a really long day. Let's just get back to school. All right. Anybody hungry? I got some turkey jerky in the trunk. I'm starving. Did you kill it? Does it matter? All right, Kelvin, you want to jump out and find that jerky bag? Trunk food. Yum. Dale, I don't see anything back here. It's back there. Hey, would you go help him? Dale, there's really nothing back here. I'm not letting either one of you jokers back in until you work out your issues. You feeling better? Feels like my brain's taking clogging lessons. I was worried about you, you got hit pretty hard. Yeah, and then the drunk guy punched me. Do you have any idea why she... Maybe would... not talk about Rebecca, please. It was awkward enough before all this. You know what? You're right. We're on spring break! Woohoo! Woo! <laughs> We get to spend an entire week on the beach with our best friends. I mean, there's only one more of these. One more? Speak for yourself. And then they kick us out into the harsh reality of 40-hour work weeks. 40 hours? Wake up, Mary Tyler Moore. Try 80. In cubicles with two weeks vacation. By the way, did I tell you I'm switching my major? Anatomy was fun, but less hands-on than I expected. <laughs> I'm sorry, Cap. About what? The fact that I don't have a plan? About the fact that I judged you for it. I was wrong. What has gotten into you? What do you mean? You're so nice and carefree and beach bay beautiful. I feel like I'm in a tampon commercial. That's because in four days I have to go back to school and figure out what I want to do with the rest of my life. What about that 10 year plan? Let's just say I copied off of someone else's paper and now I don't know what I'll be doing in 10 minutes. <laughs> I'm staring out into the vast empty ocean that is my future. Feels good, doesn't it? It does. And it feels um, terrifying. Dale, please unlock the doors. No can do, buddy. Not until you two make amends. Look, either turn off the music or leave us out here to die. The scary thing is I actually knew the words of that song. Look, I just wish you would have at least called after the prank war thing. You want to know why I didn't? Because I was mad. You made me feel like the bad guy because I chose to stay with Omega Kai and the other friends I have there. Oh, like Evan Chambers? You know, when I was outed and was gonna quit the fraternity, Evan asked me to trust him, and I did. He hasn't let me down yet. Well, what about me? I was the first person that you came out to, you remember that? Doesn't that count for something? It does, Rusty, but you're demonizing an entire fraternity full of people I like. Well, it's kinda hard to have a rational point of view of those people when they're duct-taping you to the side of a building. What about your fraternity, huh? You think the Capitals are such good guys because they're laid back and aren't ambitious? Since when did ambition become such a terrible attribute? I think in the 80s. You know, well, maybe they're right. Maybe you just can't have friends who are in rival houses. All right, this is officially the dumbest thing I've ever heard. If your stupid houses are so important, then why are both of you guys here right now instead of down at Sinners Beach? You've got to stop putting your house before everything else in your life. Before your schoolwork, before your roommate, and before each other. Do you guys think you can do that? I can agree that we were both wrong, right? So there was plenty of fault on both sides. I'm sorry. Oh, 
Three Musketeers are back. I think you might want to, um... I don't think that's a good idea. You've suffered head trauma. Besides, there are ten people sleeping in my room. I was gonna say get some breakfast. Oh! That sounds nice. Let me go get my purse. Ohio Senator Ken Logan, known for his strong stance on family values, has been implicated in a sweep of a high-end prostitution ring. As the nation reacts to the scandal, I'm all Okay, sir. Go. She needs you. About tonight. More than nothing. Kissing a boy on the beach was 11 on my list. Thanks for the help. I'm starting to feel human again. We'll process food. We'll do that for some reason. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, kind of feel like you've been blowing me off the past couple of days. Not at all. You had a lot of things you needed to do this weekend. You know, you pushed me to be more assertive and go after what I want. I'm sorry things didn't work out with you and Casey. I'm not. Um, I mean, I'm... Not looking to be another notch in the Myrtle Beach belt. Warm body rule applies even here. Yeah, I've had plenty of warm bodies. Million dollar question. Are you doing this because you want to be with me? Or because you want to get back at Casey? Million dollar question. Are you going to do this because you want to be with me? Or because you want to be with Evan Chambers? Both. Yeah. It doesn't matter now. I heard about your dad. They didn't even call me found out from a reporter. What a night. <laughs> you can say that again. Ready to explain the flip-flop? It's proof that the hotness monster does exist, and it gives me hope that I might see him again. He made quite an impression. Do you think it's possible to meet someone and just feel that they're your soulmate? Yes. But I have to believe that we have many soulmates, if not the world has a twisted sense of humor, right? What happened tonight? I was on a search mission for your monster when I ran into... You know what? No, I'm not going to tell this story. You've heard it a million times anyway, but it sounds important. What's important is I'm watching a beautiful sunrise with my best friend. <laughs> well, no matter what, we'll remember this moment forever. 
You know what would make it even more memorable? If we were naked. Okay, didn't see that coming. <laughs> it's the only thing left on my spring break list. Skinny dipping? Wanna? Please, please, please. Let's do it. Yes! <laughs> Previously, on Greek. You were my little brother, so trust me. You take this back. We're going back to Omega Kai. So Evan wins. You always said we weren't gonna let our houses get in the way of us being friends. You did nothing to stop it. It was a prank! I used to see everything in terms of whether it would piss off my parents. I just didn't want people to think that I was dating you to get to her. Calvin, you like Michael, right? I think so. Gentlemen, it's time to get your fake IDs. <laughs> Chad Stewart. Okay. Well, I'm not interested in being anyone's warm body. I'm gonna go tell Casey I'm an idiot. I don't want her back. Casey wants us to be friends. And I said I was on board, but I don't think I am. Did you pay Shane Mullen to stay away from me? Okay, yes. How could you be so spiteful? I didn't do it to be spiteful. Then why? Because I love you. I think you should take some time. Get your head together. I think we're done here. Maybe instead of trying to keep all the guys away from one girl, you should find a girl who thinks you're the only guy in the room. So, why do you want to be a lawyer? It was easier to follow Evan's path. I know what kind of law I want to practice. None. Hey, Dale, can you pick up my mail while you're you're packing? It's spring break. Why would I not be packing? Because I just assumed that you were going to be sticking around campus this week. I need a break, Rusty. You know, I'm not a machine, contrary to what my academic performance might imply. So while you're submerged in surf sand and sin with your fraternity brothers in South Carolina, I am going to be engaged in something far less reckless in Virginia. You're... Ah! I have no idea. Wild turkey hunting with my family. I was killing turkeys safer than going to the beach. Rusty, are you familiar with the dangers of spring break? Uh, I mean, drunken injury, pregnancy, Parasailing gonna rye? And what about the people injured or even killed while hunting? They're just morons. Dale, come on, this is spring break. This is the most sacred of college traditions. Why would you want to waste that on your parents? Wouldn't you rather do something with your friends? Like, take a road trip to warmer weather? As if it ever gets that cold here. All right, well, have fun killing turkeys, Dale. Have fun perpetuating stereotypes of wasted, reckless youth, Rusty. Two minutes, girls. And windows, check. The house is officially ready for lockdown, which means in two minutes, I'm officially on spring break. <laughs> Woohoo! I can feel the weight of my presidential duties lifting from my shoulders. Well, could you put it on my suitcase? We're going to Myrtle Beach for a week, not a year-long expedition to Mars. I know, but I have to bring everything that Teresa bought me. Teresa? Teresa Visa, she's very generous. But your card is a credit plus. I know, but nothing cute rhymes with credit plus. <laughs> there, you think this will fit in your car? Lucky for you, I packed. Light. All I need is sunscreen, a sarong, and an iPod filled with beach music. I am leaving the rest of my baggage behind, literally and figuratively. <laughs> well, no Jimmy Buffett. We have plenty of time to listen to him when we are old and sad. <laughs> okay, no Buffett, no ex-boyfriends, no Zeta Beta business, and most of all, no worrying about the gaping hole that is my future. I plan to flirt with boys and check things off the spring break list. Oh my god, where did you find this? Rolled up in my old beach towel. Do you remember when we made these freshman year? We were such wide-eyed spring break virgins. Well, there are still a few things on here and I'd like to finish it. Oh, like what? I'm playing a drinking game, entering a contest, and skinny dipping. Ooh, Casey Cartwright gone wild. <laughs> oh, it's time. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Spring break away! Woo okay, five, four, three, two, one. Lift up! Woohoo! Center, hurry up! You're wasting valuable party time. Get in here. Welcome aboard! We know you have many choices in travel, and we thank you for choosing Captain Tau Air. I love this bus. 
This bus is taking the Captain Tows to Myrtle Beach 32 spring breaks in a row. It is a legend. Pledge Cartwright will be surfing, ships, and four friends in the main cabin. And this bus makes only five stops, and five stops only for gas. Well, what about it only for gas? Is <laughs> it so cool? <laughs> Hi, we're checking in. Ahoy, mateys. Welcome to the Yacht House Inn, where your vacation is ship shape. How may I help you? Reservation under Zeta Beta Zeta, CRU chapter. Two rooms for the week. Enjoy. I said final answer! I think there's been a mistake. We have five rooms reserved. Uh, no, you don't. Well, then we'll take three more rooms, please, and you can put it on the card. <laughs> We're sold out, Shug. I don't know if you've heard, but it's spring break. Connie? We'd like some ice in my room, please, and a few extra towels. Yes, Miss Logan. Rebecca, you're here. And so are you. Finally. How did you beat us? We took her father's jet. <laughs> and it was awesome. <laughs> and Daddy's travel staff booked us this huge suite. You should come up to our floor later. Rebecca, wait up. <laughs> There's been a minor snafu with our reservation. Would you and the Pudges be willing to share your rooms with us sisters? After all, nobody wants to sleep on the floor. Um, actually, we were going to use this week to bond as a Pudge class. Having sisters in the room would change the dynamics, so. No problem, little sis. Um, who plans on sleeping anyway? <laughs> Check out this dingy motel, and this is even dingier than I imagined. Is that a, a car backfiring? Probably. Hey, whoever wants to hit downtown, we are leaving a horror! Isn't this place great? Only $1.99 a night? Spring break! <laughs> hey, has anyone seen my bag? <laughs> Secret weapon. So, uh, double fisting tonight, huh? No, just just single fisting. I mean, I'm single. Just an FYI. Well then, I hope to see you around. See you well. Where have you been? Just the beer run was more of a marathon. I just met the man I'm going to molest. He is crazy gorgeous and super generous. He opened our beers with his shoe. Ah, what's up, Casey? Hey! <laughs> so, who is he? Where's he from? No clue! <laughs> but that is the great thing about spring break. All new boys to play with. So, please tell me it's not the guy in the blue bag. I know how you love men with accessories. No. <laughs> okay. <sighs> who the hell is he? I'm sure he's around here somewhere. He's like a Bigfoot. No. He's the hotness monster. This is a party. It's great, huh? It's like uh, Omega Chi parties only with less clothes. Yeah, that, my friend, that is the beauty of spring break. <laughs> 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 